I suppose it's something that's in the blood. You don't do it for money. You do it for an interest. You have a liking for it. Between working with animals and working with nature. The college opened in 1967. Since then, over 2,000 farmers have been through our doors. They've learned an awful lot at Enniskillen, and the campus has had a major impact in the industry. We have strong links with the Ulster Farmers Union, with the Vaughan Trust, with Fermanagh Grassland Club, and all local farmers. To this day, there's about 50 or 60 young students that study agriculture at the college and they learn the underpinning knowledge here and then they go out onto farms and learn the practical business of farming. The campus farm here is in a unique location. It's in a very picturesque area of Fermanagh. We also use the environmental features on the farm here to help educate young students as to the importance of the environment in the, the wider scheme. The big positive of using outside farms is that students get to see different things happen in different farms across Fermanagh that they wouldn't ordinarily get access to. They're working on their home farm, coming into us for a half a day's practical and a half a day's theory. We visit the farm, we draw up training plans between the farmer, the student and ourselves to get the best learning experience for that student tiered to their individual home farm. My life here as a member of staff has been pretty much guided by my early days as a student. The input that the staff put into me as a student is what I need to now do with my students and try and encourage everybody to flourish to the best of their ability. Both my parents both work on and me having the most interest in the farm wasn't maybe as much guidance at home on how it should be run and, and what things to do. And uh, I feel I got a good start in skill on, I suppose, the basics and a good foundation to push on from. New ways of thinking and new varieties and how things worked and you sort of you learned all about photosynthesis and you learned about the cow's digestive system and things like that that you wouldn't have had. In England, you know, you learned that the cow had four stomachs. <laughs> the main advantage of doing the level three in Anaskillen was I was able to work full time at home alongside my father. The one day a week thing means we're, there's a bunch of us all in around the one age, all in the same kind of circumstances, coming from the same kind of industry. There is ones there with newer facilities, and then I'm one of the ones with an older facility, and it's, it's getting us to know what kind of outfit each one has. and different ideas we can take from each other. Each of us is taking different ideas home from each other's farms. There was 24 students in our class. It was nice to meet them fellas for the first time and 20 years later still be friendly with them and still run about with them. Contacts that I made back then are still contacts that I use now for farming. The students that we have here have a really strong passion for farming. It's our job to provide them with a really relevant education and whenever they leave us that they go forward and they understand really what's important in farming for the modern era. We're extremely proud of what we've achieved on the Skillen campus with the local farming community and we'll continue to develop our programmes to make the local farmers even better farmers.